You often see it in movies, on the internet or on the street, cats with collars. And this despite the fact that so often warned about the dangers. Cat owners who put collars around their cats' necks often smile at these warnings, or consider the danger to be low. We would like to explain you in this video why the cat collar is dangerous and why you should not use one. Number 1. Reasons for a collar. The reasons why a cat owner decides to use the collar are mostly without any real benefit. On the one hand they do it because it looks nicer, because the collars are available in all kinds of colors and shapes, on the other hand to be able to attach an address tag. Nowadays, however, this has become superfluous due to the existing microchips. In addition, the cat collar should also protect the cats from approaching cars, because they reflect. However, this is also done by the cat eyes themselves. Since cats are flight animals that usually cross the street at breakneck speed, even the best reflective collar is of no use. Also so-called flea collars can be replaced by alternative means. Number 2. What is the danger of the collar? The biggest danger is that your cat can strangle itself with the collar. Cats are active animals, which run through hedges, jump on trees or walk through the garden fence. In the process, it can quickly happen that she gets caught with the collar, or her paw gets caught on the neck. Since cats are flight animals, she will then panic and may tear off claws or get abrasions and cuts in her fur. In the worst case, this can then lead to unconsciousness and ultimately death. But even at rest, the collar can be dangerous. If she tries to pull it off her head, she may lock her own mouth. As a rule, the cat cannot free itself from this situation and if it panics here, then it can cause serious damage to the mouth. In the long run, collars can cause the fur underneath to be damaged, bald or dull due to rubbing. And number 3, safety collars are not alternatives. The industry has already designed collars that can open themselves in emergency situations. But unfortunately, these do not do so reliably. A certain pulling force must be achieved and it must be pulled from the right angle. So there is then also some luck involved and is therefore also not recommended. There are also safety collars that have an elastic band and are therefore stretchable. This is a nice idea. But in fright situations cats usually flee away to the front, so they can also get tangled with this collar. The fact that it is stretchy also makes it even easier for them to get a locked jaw. Our conclusion on collars is that the dangers definitely outweigh the benefits. The safety collars can be opened under certain circumstances in dangerous situations, but we think that the under certain circumstances does not justify the danger that the collar poses. We are therefore clearly against collars for cats. If you enjoyed this video, I would really appreciate a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel so you don't miss a new video in the future.